Hey sports fans, Coach Nick here and welcome to B-Ball Breakdown. We've got an exciting new segment folks. There's a brand new league in Europe that launched this year called the Basketball Champions League. Teams from some of the top European leagues in countries like France, Germany, Italy and Israel must qualify by being the best teams in their national leagues, creating a truly European club competition with 30 countries represented. Each week I'll spotlight highlights from their game of the week so you can get a taste of this exciting brand of basketball. Today we've got Strasbourg versus Avellino and let's pick it up midway through the first quarter. Joe Ragland dances and draws the help, enabling Adonis Thomas to attack in the middle. A big no-no, folks, as the defense is compromised, an easy kick to Cuisine for the slam. And on the weak side, this is why it's so important to always see man and ball. As soon as Lacombe turns his head, it's a great lead pass by Marty Lunin to Levi Randolph who gets the layup, and Lacombe makes matters worse by fouling and giving up the and one. It's Strasbourg's turn to get into the action with a nice pick and roll and watch the secondary play. They want to set a screen on the ball screener's man. This takes enough of his focus so he's not in position to contain the ball handler and it's an easy layup for AJ Slaughter. Into the third and here's the value of a great screen. Both defenders go to the cutter, this forces the corner to rotate and the nice kick out to Lunin who sets and fires for the three ball. Strasbourg comes back with an inside ball screen for Pape Sai, and here's why we preach no middle defense. There's no help on the backside, and Jaite gets a free lane to the cup, and the and one. More good spacing by Strasbourg on the pick and roll as it forces Lunin to guard two men, the roll man and his own man on the baseline. Easy decision for Slaughter, and Eric Murphy nails the little baseline jumper. The pick and roll was a problem all night for Avellino and they simply must get Randolph to bump down and knock this pass away. Instead, it's an easy layup for Matt Howard and Strasbourg never looked back as they won this game 63-57. Stay tuned next week as we'll break down even more highlights from some of the most exciting basketball Europe has to offer. The Basketball Champions League.